Oh, we got some strong winds here. It's Mr. Gates talking tornado safety with you. I'll tell you how to be safe here <clears throat> during tornado season. Actually, you never know when a tornado is going to hit. We're just going to talk to you about how to be safe and when you are most likely to encounter a tornado. Let's start off with our safety tips here. We've got a duck up there. Duck and, where is it at? Cover. Duck and cover during a tornado. Find a safe spot. Know the safest place in the building at home. Where should you be? When you get to one of these safe locations, you gotta make sure that you duck and cover. Duck and cover. Get under somewhere safe. If you can get underneath something in one of those purple rooms, that's great. Duck and cover. Stay away from windows and things that might fall on you. And always, duck and cover. If you happen to be outside during a tornado and you can't get in, try to find a ditch and do the old DNC. Duck and cover. My flight flat on the ground. Cover up. Get away from the windows and the outside walls. Try to get to kind of the middle of the building. I said, you gotta make sure during a tornado, you don't go outside, stay away from doors and windows. The building has a basement and you can get to it, go to the basement. Best place to be is probably underneath the stairs. So you have some kind of over overhead cover there. <clears throat> and also know the plan, all right? Many public buildings have emergency plans posted all over the place. Get familiar with them, so in case of emergency, you know where to go. As you can see in this diagram here, for a tornado, you wanna to remain in the purple rooms listed there. If you are not, get to one of those purple rooms when the tornado siren goes off. You got to know where you're at and what the plan is. Every kind of public building has a fire plan and a tornado plan. So looking at some safety tips here. Let's look to the top right. Know the signs. Look for swirling clouds. Watch for quick wind shifts. Heavy rain. Listen for loud roar or rumble that doesn't fade. <clears throat> These are signs a tornado might be in the area. Practice your plan and prepare. Talk to your family about it. What should you do? At school, we practice a couple times. If you're outside, you must seek shelter. Ooh. Ooh. Go team, go! Defense! What, there's a tornado coming? Okay, if you can't, just lie face down on the ground with your arms protecting your head. <clears throat> Stay away from trees and cars. We'll see a picture, what a picture of what that looks like later. And then after the storm, stay away from down power lines, avoid flooded areas, and also uh, serious damaged buildings. You don't know if there's a gas leak, if the floor has moved, and now it's not stable to go into. Um, so just be aware of that afterwards. So winds in a tornado can reach up to 300 miles an hour. Look, there's a tornado coming. Everybody run outside. That's crazy. Can you imagine your dog hanging out the window during a tornado 300 miles an hour? We're probably looking at about 40 miles an hour here, and this is what they look like 300 miles an hour. Crazy. Blow you right over. If you are outdoors, again, lie face down. Protect your head and your neck. Get away from stuff that could be blown around. Look at this huge truck or train, piece of train there. Um, tornado just whips it up in the air, and it's got to come down somewhere. Right? It would be best if you were inside and you were protected. Hey, there's a tornado coming. All right, let me just finish my shower. So let's look. We're in Illinois here. Tornado season, usually April, May, June. But they could happen any time of the year. 
All right, these are the most common. That is when the season starts changing. We have that cold and that warm air kind of mixing together in April, May, and June. And that's where we most commonly see it. But again, it can happen at any time. This has been an Air Gates production. Hope you enjoyed it. Let's be safe, especially uh, during tornado season. Know the plan. Practice the plan. We have one at school. Do you have one at home? And always, duck and cover. Where do you most commonly hang out? Where are these places at? And what the plan? what is the plan? Find that out. Be safe out there. Thanks for watching.